What's up, folks? Garden State Geek, and we're back at it again. We got some uh, Digimon packs finally been uh, found. Some uh, 1.0 and 1.5. Uh, we'll get right into it, and we'll talk about uh, what's been going on with me lately in the game. Uh, sadly, I haven't been able to play as much as I'd like. Uh, just a lot going on in the personal life. Um, but uh, last tournament I were at, Rookie Rush just was all over the place, and it was just a pain. Uh, but I, I played Red Omni. Uh, I, I enjoy the deck. It just, with Rookie Rush out there, it's so hard sometimes. Oh, what are we doing here? I'm already doing this wrong. See, that's how long it's been. Oh, I'm dropping cards too. Let's do Egg Roulette, because uh, we don't get to do that as much with uh, 1.5. We got Red. All right, let's see what our uh, first card is. Breath of the Gods, followed by, holy shit. Holy shit, that is what we're talking about. Omnipon Alter S. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Let's leave that right up. Oh, man. Okay. Wow. Uh, what a way to start the video. Uh, I definitely needed another one of these guys. Oh, uh, wow. Oh, uh, what a beautiful card. Okay. Ah. Uh, Oh, I guess that's where my, my luck's been waiting to go, huh? Wow. That's, I, I, I'm still taking it back. Omnimon, Alter S. Like I said, I, I only had one, and I really didn't want to pay individual prices for one. Hey, egg roulette again. I'm going to say blue this time, and it's purple. But that's okay. Wow. Uh, holy crap. Okay. Uh, our rare this time is, uh, our first card today is Phoenix Mon. Fought by Ragnar Lordmon. Uh, that's a great deck too. Uh, see some people playing it. it it's good and bad. Uh, Matchup wise, it just gets kind of run all over. Sadly, sometimes. Uh, but uh, I I played against a uh, Rag Ragnar Lordmon in the last tournament I was in, and yeah, I sadly just ran all over him. He uh, they have to give you so much memory, and for red for red Omni, that's that's just free real estate all day, which is a bad way to go. But egg roulette, uh, yellow. Ah, we got red. Okay. Let's see. We got Metal Greymon as a rare, followed by Ophanamon. Beautiful card. Um, state of the game, though. Uh, the game's going, I think the game's doing okay. Um,. Some things are starting to settle down. Uh, it's good to see that starter decks are starting to settle in price a bit. Somewhat, not really. Black. Um, I mean, I, trying to find a starter deck below 20 bucks is impossible at this point. Ooh, first rear of Vimon for all the rookie rush out there. Followed by Rina Shinomiya. Um, but, uh... They are settling a little bit because more of them are getting out there, but I, I think it's still the average price for a red starter is like 30 or 35 and the average price for uh, the other two are like 20 or 25 depending on the stores and everything. And we're going to start with Ken Ichijoji. Ichijoji? <laughs> so butchering these names. And Stingmon. Great card for uh, green right there. So that was our 1.5 packs and we got a uh, 1.0 can we double omni that would be uh amazing i would uh i don't even know what i do i'm dropping stuff that's okay but uh whew. started off right here we go keep that separate hey we're starting with metal cedramon and taiga um Keep their rare separate. Uh, just just a heads up. Uh, singles, commons, and uncommons for even set 1.0. Uh, prices are insane right now. Uh, I was kind of shocked to find. I think it was Demimon or whatever. It's now like a three dollar card for a comp or an uncommon. Uh, it's great for for some of us. Bad for people trying to get the game. I feel like, but uh, we're gonna start with Symphony Number One, Polyphony, and ooh, Zudamon. Great card. Great card uh, for blue coming up here. I think it's going to be uh, 
I think people are sleeping on it a little bit. Um, if you don't have a playset, I would suggest trying to get a playset. Uh, it's a great blue card. Uh, I'm excited to see Rookie Rush die, though. And I even play Rookie Rush, and I'm still excited to see Rookie Rush uh, die hard. But we're going to start with our boy Joe Kiddo and Lilymon, staple for green decks. Ooh, 1.0, come on. Don't let 1.5 show you up like this. You, you, you're you better than this. I got faith in you. Um, but yeah, the variety of decks out there is still great. Uh, one of the things I do love about the game, uh, you know, the, the tournaments I have been to, it wasn't all the same decks, so great health for the game. Uh, we're going to start with the rare Mon, followed by, oh, great, uh, War Grey Mon. Uh, great uh, SR. Um... This is about to get a boost, I think, in this set or the next set. But uh, great SR. Again, beautiful art because one thing Digimon has going for it is great art. And our last pack, and then we'll end uh, this video. But uh, it's been a lot of fun. Ooh, we got real egg roulette because, you know. So what are we thinking? I'm going to say blue because I love blue. Ah, red for Yokomon. Followed by, ooh, uh, always a great pull, Flower Cannon, uh, solid card. I forget, you know, we're going we're gonna to sleeve that one up just because it's a, such an in-demand card and a great card at that. Uh, if you're playing green and you don't have this in the deck, you are uh, missing out. Um, but let's go over the pulls. Or the big pulls, I should say. So as you just saw, we had Flower Cannon. Great card. Great staple for green. War Greymon. Zoodlemon. Ragnalordmon. And then the Big Daddy. Omnimon Alter S. I am still uh, in shock. What an amazing pull. What a great way to start this video. Um, and uh, I'm so happy to finally have a second one. Um, thank you all for watching. Don't forget to like, favorite, subscribe, and, uh, we'll see you all in the next one. Have a great day, guys.